What's up guys? Welcome to today's video. My name is Sarah. If you don't know me, hi, hello, hey, what's up? So in today's video, I am doing a what I eat in a day. I have a lot of food restrictions, so I am allergic to nuts. I am vegetarian and I also don't eat wheat. Enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up, and thanks for watching. Good morning, I just woke up. I like to have my water bottle right next to me in the morning so when I wake up I can just start chugging water because it's good for you and it just like gets me going, so cheers. <laughs> and now it is breakfast and coffee time. It is breakfast time. I have oatmeal, I have a nice big bowl of oatmeal. This is just like plain rolled oats and I like to put cinnamon in it and then a bunch of frozen fruit on top. Usually I put a banana, but I'm so sad there's no banana in my house right now. And I'm also drinking my coffee. This is just plain black coffee. I know it's super boring. I love putting sugar in my coffee, but it's not great for you. Um, and it just, it tastes so good, but just like pouring sugar just to like consume it, I just, I can't do it. Sometimes I can do it, but I try not to. And I'm used to drinking just like plain black coffee. I don't think it tastes the best, but because I do it most of the times, I'm just like used to the taste. So this is what I normally opt for. I'm gonna eat now. So it is noon now. I just made lunch. I'm so excited to eat this, you guys. It is a bunch of veggies. So we have onion, bell pepper, carrots, spinach. I think I hit them all, and then I put some brown rice in there and put a few drops of soy sauce to give it some extra flavor. I was gonna make a salad as well, but I kinda made a ton of food and it might be too much for me, so I might make a salad after if I'm still hungry, but we'll see, kinda just seeing how it goes. Yummy. Oh, hot. Ooh. I think after I eat, I'm gonna study. So I'm studying for the TEAS test. If you don't know what that is, it's a standardized test that you have to take to get into nursing school. And I'm applying to nursing schools right now. And I am super nervous about it and like stressed about it. And I have to do well on this test. And I just don't like taking tests. That's why I'm studying way in advance. And hopefully I do. Okay, that's all. That's all for now, bye. So I'm getting pretty hungry. I've been studying really fun and yeah so definitely need a snack right now and i am having or about to have i haven't had them yet these are the quinoa and black bean tortilla chips from trader joe's i love these they're so good and i'm going to have it with some guacamole um these are the holy guacamoles and they come in just like oh really it looks like barf These are my old anatomy notes. <laughs> Hold on, I'll be right back. Well, that was fun to clean up. Anyways, on that note, I'm gonna eat my snack and study some more. And I hope you guys are having a good day. Awesome, thank you. There's literally no one at in and out This has never happened in my whole entire life. Hey, hi, hello. I have very exciting news. I just went to in and out I'm like the happiest person ever. I don't think you understand. Okay, so I went to the mall because I had a return to make and then I got a couple things at Sephora. It was fun. And um, there is an In-N-Out right by my mall. So I just decided to go there because sometimes you just need In-N-Out in your life. And if you don't have an In-N-Out where you live, I'm sure you have some type of fast food that you love. And this is in and out for me. So I get a grilled cheese. There's a french fry in it. I get a grilled cheese, but I get it protein style, so there's no bread. I just get it like in a lettuce wrap. And then so there's cheese in it, pickle, onion, tomato. It's so good, I love it. And then I just got some fries. Um, but this thing literally makes me so happy. So I'm back home in my room about to eat my in and out. Seriously, the happiest person. And hey, this is a what I eat in a day, and sometimes I eat in and out in a day, like today. Because you have to treat yourself things that you love, that will make you happy. That's what I've learned in life. You know, you can eat all the healthy food in the world, but if you don't, if you don't have french fries in your life, then I don't know. I don't know about that life. 
for me anyways, because I love french fries. So I can't live without. Oh, I love ketchup on it. it tastes so good. I also love in and out because they have options for me. So I feel like I'm a picky eater and like, I have just like so many elements about my diet that like I can't eat. I don't eat wheat. I am allergic to nuts. I'm a vegetarian. There's like quite a few like food restrictions that I follow. I don't know, it's just nice like having a place that like has food that you like taste so good and that you can eat. So I appreciate it. Also, I said I don't eat wheat. Um, I did put soy sauce in my rice. I put a little bit of soy sauce. Um, there is wheat in that. I just thought I would clarify in case any of you caught that. I don't know if you did, but I don't have celiac disease. I am not like crazy allergic to wheat. Um, I just have like a sensitivity or intolerance if you want to call it that. It's a really long story, but basically in 11th grade, I got super, super sick, had to cut a bunch of things out of my diet. Wheat was one of them. And then I slowly introduced things back into my diet and wheat was the one thing I wasn't able to introduce back into my diet. How many times can I say diet in a sentence? I eat it occasionally. Doesn't make me feel the best usually, so I usually just stay away from it. But I if I have it in small increments, like in soy sauce, there's like not a lot of wheat in that and I barely use any. So it really doesn't affect me. Um, so I just do it in moderation, but really not at all. But sometimes I do. So I just wanted to clarify that. Anyways, do you guys have any food restrictions or allergies? I'm always curious to know because I feel like I relate to people who have like allergies and yeah anyways let me know or if you're like a vegetarian or something that's cool too what's the difference between a mukbang and a what i eat in a day i mean i didn't talk to you guys that much while i ate but i feel like right now i am it's like a two-in-one kind of video all right i'm gonna go enjoy this i'll catch up with you guys soon well i guess that's it for my video today um i usually don't eat anything after i eat dinner so I guess I'm signing off. If you guys liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to see more of my face. You can follow me on Instagram or not. That's cool too. And I will see you guys later. Bye.